I'm here live with Chad Adams, senior forward for the Lobos from Highland High School. How are you doing today, Chad? I'm good, man. Good. Uh, so we all know we got the season kickoff on Monday night, 11:59 on ESPN. Um, what are your thoughts and expectations going into this season? Um, I think everybody's uh, expecting good things out of the program. Um, we do pretty good every year, and I think uh, as a whole, the team is just expecting us um, out of ourselves for us to come out and you know produce and um, play big on the court. So yeah, especially with the. Uh, is it back to back, right? Yeah. Conference champions, so yeah. trying to go for a three peat, of course. Mm -hmm. All right. Um, I know Coach Alfred is going to use a lot of four guards with one big man this year, mm -hmm. and uh, so he's expecting like yourself, Hugh, Tony, to step up with the rebounds. Are you and your teammates ready to take on that challenge? Yeah, well, that's pretty much all he talks about is uh, everybody just coming out and being good rebounders because uh, we are going to be undersized. Uh, we are, like you said, going to be running the four-guard lineup most of the season. So when um, the four-guard is, like, really small, like Demetrius is, like, a 6'3 or something like that, then it's big for us to come out and box out and rebound and stuff like that. So that's a really big focus this year. Yeah, you're definitely going to need need to be battling in there. Yeah. <laughs> All right, uh, what's the buzz like uh, in the locker room leading up to this midnight game? I mean, playing on ESPN in front of in front of the whole country on Monday night, what does that mean to you guys? Um, everybody's looking forward, uh, forward to it. I mean, um, honestly, like even through our, our two exhibitions, like we were really focused on this game because it's the first game. Um, I don't think anybody's really nervous about playing in front of a, a big crowd or playing on TV because we've done it before, but everybody's pretty much looking forward to the opportunity because, um, once again, they, they're not really showing us any love through the uh, the media polls and stuff like that, so we're, we're obviously trying to get in the top 25 and stuff like that, so, I mean, it's a really big game for us. We're looking forward to it. Yeah, it's going to be sweet. Yeah. Can't wait. Yeah. <laughs> All right, um... Since you grew up in uh, the city of Albuquerque, can you explain to me how the fans in the city have supported you through your first three years and continuing on through this year? Well, Albuquerque's always been great. I mean, uh, obviously I have all my friends and stuff out here. Um, it's it's like home. I mean, um, of course I wasn't born here, but I've been here so long that I just know a lot of people. Um, I could pretty much go anywhere and see somebody that I do know. So, I mean, I always feel the love out here. Um, as far as the support goes, I mean, the city's always supported me and had my back. I mean, even when uh, I got my DWI and was going through some rough times. So uh, I do love Albuquerque. I mean, it's a good place. So. Yep. Okay. Um, let's see. What is it, what's it like when, just describe to me the feeling of what's it like walking down the ramp, sold out arena, you see the sea of red, thousands and thousands of fans screaming. What's that like? Um... I mean, it's cool, like, uh, your adrenaline is just pumping, like, when you when you walk down the ramp and there's just 15,000 fans out there, it's just, like, it's, you get chills, like, you get a rush, but, I mean, it's, like, the greatest feeling in the world, you just want to go out there and perform and do your best, I mean, I wouldn't even say it's a nervous feeling, it's more of an excitement, you know, but uh, it's definitely something you'll remember for the rest of your life, so it's a great experience. So you're overall... Very happy with choosing UNM? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it was a really good choice. Um, I had some other scholarships, but I think um, the school that I chose to come to is probably one of the best choices I've made. So, I mean, I'm not really disappointed or wishing I had went somewhere else yeah. at this point. Okay, so one more thing. It's been three years now, and I've been waiting and waiting, me, myself, and <laughs> many, many people. You already know where I'm going with this one. <laughs> Am I going to see a dunk out of Chad Adams this year? Yeah, you. I think you're going to see a couple of dunks this year. I've been doing some squats and stuff. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I mean, I'm getting a little older now, but <laughs> I, my, leg, my legs aren't that old, so hopefully hopefully I'll get up there on somebody this year. All I tried right, to man. put uh, Merv, Merv in the rim yesterday. <laughs> he fouled me, but I mean. All right, man. Well, thank you for your time, and best of luck this season. For sure.